solo woman safety <laughs> when you travel. Okay, this happened last night and it hasn't happened since 2007. Um, one of the benefits of getting older is you don't get the unwanted attention as much as you did 10 years ago. So here I am in a hot springs. I'll tell you where later. And just sitting watching the sunset. This is a family place. This isn't the kind of place that you run around naked like so many of them are. No, you are clothed here in bathing suits. Anyway, so I'm watching the sunset in this guy who's obviously been drinking because he keeps repeating himself and can't remember my name after one second <laughs> starts getting a little too chummy kissing my hand a couple of times this is in like a five minute conversation because I put an end to it um so what I wanted to talk about is the safety factor when you're by yourself because as a woman and this has happened to me in many countries Somebody will come up, oh, are you by yourself? Where are you staying? How old are you? Are you married? Do you have children? What do you do for a living? Where are you from? Where are you going? Like, all of this shit he asked me. Anyway, um, <clears throat> the, here's when I got ugly. He, As soon as he sat down, he was asking me if he could sit down, but didn't wait for the answer. So sat down. And the thing is, you don't have to have unwanted attention. I figure, well, you know, this is a family place. I'll so just talk to him for a few seconds. You know, this is, it's dark. There's not that many people around, but the owner is still here. Because I can see the light on in the hot tub, in the hot springs place. So, <clears throat> he asked if I want to drink some beer with him. No. And then, here's when it went not no way um i told him he needs to be with someone he can have children with he's about 30 years younger than me you want to know how old i was and finally just to get rid of him I'm like i'm 66 <laughs> he's completely shocked so children aren't happening at this address then he wants my number and starts shoving his phone at me okay so that's really gross I said no. He wanted to know why. We can be friends, all this crap. Okay, so I'm leaving now. But then I'm like, oh, darn it. You know, my van is right here. I'm camping here, and I don't... Well, okay, here's a precaution. You don't ever want someone to know where you're staying, what you're staying in, that you're alone. So he knew all this. So I'm not too happy about that. So then... A few minutes later, he's like, Mary, you want to drink some beer? And he has two beers approaching my van. No. No, I don't. So I firmly was like, no, good night. He was bewildered by that. And then I called the owners. Um, and the owner came over. He happened to be here. But, you know, I actually did get scared. And why I wanted to do this... Um, video is because, you know, I think I've gotten a little bit complacent with thinking, oh, you know, it's not going to happen to me. Like, I was by myself and there weren't many people and, you know, it felt a little bit scary. So, the thing is, here's the tip. You want to not reveal too much about yourself, especially when you're by, you're alone. And you don't want to be associated with the vehicle that you came in. And, um, this guy's coming to this hot springs looking for women. You know, he's not even staying here. I'm camping here. So, don't let people know too much. I mean, you can, like, I'm pretty friendly, but he was going over the line. So, the safety tip is, as soon as you send something going wrong, either get help. And I'm glad I called because the owner came over. And he's a big guy, and he's like, oh, it's, it's usually safe here. And I said, yeah, it is. I've stayed here before. It's also always safe when you look like a Viking. <laughs> no kidding, he really does. <laughs> so he hasn't had any trouble in a long time. <laughs> See, and the thing about being a woman is it is more vulnerable. So 10 years ago when I uh, was traveling... I got a lot more unwanted attention. And one of the best things about getting older is 
I don't get as much attention and I'm happy about that because you can kind of slip in and out places and look more like a local and you know, it, it really is better to be older. So if you're young, cute, hot and sexy, you gotta have your boundaries firmly in place and don't even question it. If you have a bad feeling about somebody, get the hell out of there before something escalates call somebody, say you're meeting your husband. I mean, whatever you can do, let them know firmly. You know, don't try to have manners. Um, I know it can backfire. Sometimes when you reject a man, they get they can get ugly, but this didn't happen. And hopefully, you know, it's not a big place here. We saw a car pulling out, we figured it was him. But just to stay safe, um, always trust your gut and get away from situations that you have any feeling of doom about, okay? So, have fun out there.